I lost a lot of money a year or two back on something called CPP, the uh, credit card uh, protection fraud operated from York. I never realized they could ever pump the share price up as high as they did. And uh, through market practice, I had to close that position at a loss to me of 550,000 pounds. But I, looking back, uh, had I kept the position in CPP open, had I been allowed to in the market, then I would have made a profit. But I mean, that happens in markets. And the answer to that is uh, one shouldn't get oneself into that position in the first place. Is there, well, one, oh. is there one wrong sell where that you thought, now that caught me unawares and I learned something specific from it that you hadn't expected? Well, you may remember I referred to CPP a year or two back. There I misjudged the attitude of the controlling shareholder and Schroeder's as an institutional investor. And I presumed that because of the steps they had taken, there were other conclusions to draw. I was wrong. And I suppose it's a reminder that uh, in this life you do have to check. <laughs> yes, you certainly have to check things, that's for sure. Okay, what about a, a single most important lesson then from past trading decisions? Is, what is the one thing that you would say to anybody, you know? You're, oh yes, you're only as good as your last trade. I think that is true, yes.